Magandang araw, SPCians! Magandang araw, online world! Welcome to Experience SPC, Virtual Open House 2020. We are streaming live on San Pablo College's Facebook page, YouTube channel, and official website, www.sanpablocolleges.edu.ph. I will be your host for today at sasamahan ko po kayo upang mas kilalanin pa ang isa sa mga tanyag na eskwelahan dito sa San Pablo City, ang San Pablo Colleges. Para sa araw na ito, sasamahan tayo ng ating mga respetadong principals, deans at department heads. Mrs. Mary Rosal Dua, Officer in Charge, Grade School Department. Professor Josefina Velicina, Principal, Junior High School Department. Professor Araceli Ortega, Principal, Senior High School Department. Professor George Resurrection, Program Chair, College of Computer Studies. Professor Olivia Reyes, Dean, College of Accountancy and College of Business Administration. Dr. Bernard Lunar, Dean, College of Education and Graduate School. Simula na po natin ang ating panayam. Please tell us more about your respected department, programs, academic and non-academic activities, pati po ang ating mga clubs and organizations. Let's start with our grade school department. Magandang umaga po sa lahat. The Grade School Department of San Pablo Colleges offers nursery program for our incoming four years old children. We also have our kindergarten program for incoming uh, five years old children. And then we have our grades one to six levels. Uh, we have different uh, academic and non-academic organizations or clubbings in our department. For the academic clubs, we have the Young Journalists and Young Mathematicians Club. For our non-academic clubs, we also have a sports club, dance club, young artists club, and choir club. Good morning. So in, in the junior high school department, we are Pakukowa level 2 accredited. And then in academic program, we have the clubbings, the, the English club, the Specian club, and then the Young Scientist club, the Young Historian club, and the Mountaineering club. And then in, we, we are offering elective subjects like, for example, um, advanced bio, advanced chemistry, journalism, and research. That's all. Good morning everyone. In senior high school, we offer all academic tracks, the accountancy, business, and management, um, so humanities and social sciences, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, and the general academic strand. We also offer um, tech book, which composed of the uh, home economics, and uh, information communication technology and of course arts and uh, design and sports track good morning so for the college of computer studies actually we offer two four-year courses we have the bachelor of science in computer science and we have the bachelor of science in information technology and we also have this two-year program we have the associate in computer technology now, we have our organizations called SITES, and uh, it's Society of Information Technology Students. And we are actually affiliated with iSITES, PSITE, and NSITE. And one thing more is that, ang isa sa pinagmamalaki namin is that lahat actually ng mga uh, faculty members namin are all graduated our master's degree. And most of us actually now are taking our doctorate degree. So, isa pa sa pinagmamalaki ng department namin is yung mga graduates namin. Kasi if you're going to look, most of them, sila ay talagang ang kanilang trabaho ngayon are totally in parallel dun sa kanilang course na kinuha. So, we are proud of them kasi iba nasa abroad na, iba they have their own families, they have their, their career talaga na uh, pwede natin ipagmalaki bilang SPC. Good morning. The College of uh, Accountancy and Business Administration offers various courses such as the Bachelor of Science in Accountancy, the graduates of which will be entitled 
to take the CPA board examination. And then we have the Bachelor of Science in Business Administration, where we offer a uh, major in financial technology, uh, which actually is uh, a course in accountancy also, where you, can, you will not be allowed to take the, the board examination, but you can go to the various fields of accountancy. And we also have the uh, major in marketing management, major in uh, human resource development. Um, we have the, also the Bachelor of Science in Real Estate Management, which is a new course in our department. And uh, of course, the Bachelor of Science in Hotel and Restaurant Management. We also offer Bachelor of Science in Hospitality Management and a two-year associate in Hospitality Management. Our students are uh, members of various organizations. The accountancy students have their Junior Philippine Institute of Accountants. We have the uh, organization of the business administration students, um, the uh, Marketing Society, Human Resource Development Society, and then we have the Hospitality Management Society. The College of Education of San Pablo Colleges offers different programs. These are Bachelor of Elementary Education, Bachelor of Special Needs Education, Bachelor of Early Childhood Education, Bachelor of Secondary Education with different specializations like English, Filipino, Mathematics, Social Studies, Science, and Values Education. Likewise, it also offers Bachelor of Physical Education and Bachelor of Technology and Livelihood Education with major in Home Economics. The Graduate School Program of San Pablo Colleges includes Doctor of Education with specialization in Educational Management. It has also Doctor in Business Administration, Master of Arts in Educational Management, Master of Arts in English, Master of Arts in Filipino, Master of Arts in Guidance and Counseling, Master in Business Administration, and Master of Arts in Nursing with specialization in Nursing Administration. Next question naman po tayo, no? Nagsimula na kanina si Sir George na ipagmalaki ang kanyang department. Ngayon naman, balikan natin yung, yung inyong po mga sagot. Ano yung may ipagmamalaki ng inyong mga department? Let's start with Mamoli. Um, we are very proud of uh an excellent lineup of faculty members in our department. Um, our faculty members who are teaching accounting subjects are all certified public accountants and officers of the various uh, accountant organizations in the country. And uh, our other faculty members are, um, are all master's degree holder and uh, well, our students had been doing good in various uh, contests outside of uh, the school, wherein they, they uh, especially the accountancy students who have been joining various uh, contests in different parts of uh, the country. And uh, our graduates are doing good in their fields. The accountants, uh, the certified public accountants are um, in the various um, big firms in uh, Manila. And uh, when you go to the Bureau of Internal Revenue, you can see that uh, most of the examiners there in the region are graduates of San Pablo Colleges. You go to the different offices in San Pablo City and of I'm sure you'll be able to find uh, our graduates there who are in the, the different, uh, who hold different uh, positions in those offices. Um, our hospitality management students are in various parts of the world. Uh, most of them are in the Middle East. There are those who are in uh, working in uh, cruises and uh, the big uh, hotels 
in Manila, like Sofitel, uh, Manila Hotel, and others. And uh, some of them also have uh, uh, their own businesses in the city. Um, I, I uh, remember there are there is also a time that uh, one, uh, one of our accountancy graduates landed number ten in the certified public accountancy accounting examination. Okay, malami salamat po. Ngayon naman ano naman po ang pagmamalaki ng College of Education D. Okay, so as for the College of Education, it shares its pride for having been um, accredited or given um, level 3 re-accredited status by Bako Pako It shares it with the oh, yeah. College of Business and the Liberal Arts. So that's one. And uh, in terms of our graduates, so we are proud of our graduates as they are, if not if most of them, if not all, are teaching and have been holding um, educational administration positions in various public and private element, elementary and high schools, and even college, uh, college, local colleges and, and uh, universities. And uh, as per our roster of faculty members, uh, we can be proud of our faculty members as they are a good mix of um, um, licensed uh, teachers who have a um, master's degree and doctorate degree. Um, we have also relevant community extension activities as we have adapted uh, one daycare center uh, in Kalihan. And we can say that we are, both the teachers and students are actively participating in research. Uh, in terms of instruction, I would say that um, we are providing quality instruction with, uh, with us, of course, the teachers that we have and the curriculum that we offer. Huwag na natin kakalimutan yung mga top notchers na na-produce ng college Yes, so we're able to produce uh, top notchers in the licensure exam. Uh, one landed uh, second and the other landed sixth in the previous uh, licensure exam. Sa graduate school naman po? Okay, for the graduate school, um, we can say that uh, we are proud of our uh, faculty members because we only um, hire um, teachers or professors who are um, doctorate degree holders and these uh, faculty members are also uh, engaged in research and other uh, scholarly activities like um, publication and uh, instructional materials production. And as for our graduates um, of the graduate school, so most of them are um, holding key positions in different uh, schools and uh, colleges and universities. Thank you, Dean. Let's uh, ask Sir George of CCS. Ano naman po ang uh, pride ng inyong department? Okay, so bagayan yung sinabi ko kanina, I think number one would be instruction. Because uh, as we can see, all of our faculty members do have their uh, master's degree, and uh, most of us actually is uh, having our doctorate degree now. And we we do not actually stop for seeking uh, new things in technology for our students. And one thing then is that uh, there are most of our students also has their own. Uh, uh, landed jobs that are in parallel with their courses and some of them actually has their own uh, start, started up their own businesses uh, in, in technology and we're, we're really proud of them and most of them are really in abroad and they are really uh, doing well there and uh, we're proud of, of them being an anesthesia and one thing then is that uh, our faculty members it's not just, it's not just uh, teachers or faculty, we were also freelance programmers. So we also do software development. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Good to know that our graduates are really doing well in uh, their respective fields. Now let's proceed to uh, Professor Araceli Ortega of Senior High School. Well, in Senior High School, parents and, teacher and students 
can be assured of quality education because our teachers are well trained. They will also be. Uh, they will also equip our students with all the necessary skills and um, competencies that will prepare them for college education. And let me just boast. Uh, you say something about the senior high school department. Uh, we are winners, back-to-back -back winners of the different home uh, economic contest or cooking contest. And of course, our perhaps pinaka achievement namin is winning the 1 million pesos from the biotechnology contest. So San Pablo Colleges is the I mean, emerge champion among the 25 schools all over the country. And not only that, our students do not only excel academically, uh, some of them also won various beauty contests because I would like to say that senior high school students are not only pretty, but they also possess beauty. Yeah. Of course, mm -hmm. we believe in that. Short span of time pa lang po ng senior high school yes. department, but it's achieving a lot diba, sa mga years na yun. Thank you, Ma'am Shing. Okay. Let's ask uh, the principal of junior high school department. So first is that because our teachers are very competent and then we, we join in the outside competition and so on. And then since they are only junior high school, but when they become college, they are the students of our different department. So they are, what do you call this one? Uh, they are highly trained. Uh, talaga din na-develop po natin yung mga batas, their skills and potential. And, uh, dagdag lang din po doon, ano, uh, sinasabi natin na pinakamahalaga sa lahat yung foundation ng bata. That is why I'd like to ask Ma'am Rose of grade school. Yes, Jai. Um, the grade school department of SPC has been granted with level 2 re-accredited status by BAC. By PACOPOA, the Philippine Association of Colleges and Universities Commission on Accreditation. So for me, this status attests the kind and quality of education that we are giving our client groups. Our curriculum is well balanced and integrated and paired with strong um, spiritual and Christian values. We also have our resident college chaplain in the name of Father Loreto Soto of the Missionaries of Faith. Um, he's the one helping us attend to the different spiritual needs of our learners. Part also of our curriculum is to promote our culture. We have the Pagmamano. We are teaching our learners to preserve that culture of Pagmamano or asking blessings from our elders. We also have our honesty campaign. Uh, we also have our English speaking campaign in the department. Um, our teachers from nursery to grade six levels are very competent and they are all licensed passers or licensed holders. Uh, humility aside, our learners when they join different off campus competition, be it DepEx sponsored contests or NGO sponsored contest, they are bringing home different major awards, uh, even from district to national level. So I think those are the things which I can be proud of of our great school. Thank you po sa inyo lahat. I really like uh, yung sinabi niyo po, Ma'am Rose, na hindi lamang academic activities or extracurricular activities ang pinagtutukunan natin ng pansin. But of course, the values education na itinutukunan natin at itinabahagi sa ating mga SPCs. Yes, and one thing more, we also have a very cooperative and supportive parents association who are always with us mm -hmm. in implementing these activities which we think are really uh, good for our lives. Thank you po. Okay, this question is for uh, senior high school department. Ma'am Ching, ito para po sa ating mga viewers na nagbabalak, syempre, na of course, kinoconsider ang San Pablo Colleges for their senior high school. Ano po ba yung mga dapat isa alang-alang ng mga bata sa pagpili ng kanilang strand? Uh, first and foremost, I think, is what do they want to take up in college? 
because senior high school is preparatory for college. So the students need to know what do I really want to take up in college so that we can help them to choose their strand. Other is that they also need to consider their capabilities, you know, because, well, it's not all like Kaya ko po ba ito? Di po ba? Because when you love what you're doing, then I think you will give it your best. So it's what you want to take up in college and your ability. Thank you so much, Mom Ching, and hopefully nakatulong po yung uh, sagot na yun sa ating pong mga viewers na yun. And this next question is for our deans. Uh, of course, Sir George, ikaw muna ang unahin ko. No? For CCS, ano po ba yung career opportunities na nag-aabang para sa inyong mga graduates? Ako, Jai, pagdating sa College of Computer Studies, sobrang dami. As in, uh, dalawang side kasi yan eh. Can be on software and can be on hardware. Pagdating sa software, Siyempre, can be a programmer, or a web developer, or a systems analyst, you can be a database administrator, you can be an IT consultant, you can be um, an IT specialist. No? So, ang dami, no? ang dami pwede. Pagdating sa, sa hardware part, pwede ka nang maging network administrator, pwede kang maging network architect, Pwede kang IT technician, computer technician, name it, ang dami. So talaga, pagdating sa College of Computer Studies, ikaw yung mamimili kung saan appropriate na skill ka. So, doon ka mag-apply or do, you, you can, you can uh, actually uh, perform your best doon. Hmm. Kaya ang dami talaga. Kung yun yung linya nyo, uh, the best yes. ang uh, computer studies para po sa inyo. Okay, ngayon. Si Sir, Sir Lunar naman, Dean, for the College of Education. Yeah, for the College of Education, also for the Graduate School for Education. Um, I can summarize the career opportunities into four. Of course, first would be teaching. So that's the first and foremost career opportunity for a College of Education graduate. And the second one would be uh, in the form of education administration. By education administration, I mean he or she can be a principal, she can be hired uh, by the Department of Education, um, the Commission on Higher Education, and for other education-related um, jobs. Uh, apart from that, uh, one education graduate can also serve as a school um, counselor. School counseling is another um, job opportunity, and. Um, some graduates would land as um, school um, community community service officer or community extension officer. So these are the four major areas where our graduates can uh, be employed. Thank you so much, Dean. Dean Olive, for the College of Accountancy and College of Business Administration, ano naman po yung naghihintay na job opportunity sa kanila? You see, in the uh, accountancy profession, you can be in any of the four major fields. Mm -hmm. uh, we have the public practice, public accountancy, when they, you can have uh, offer your services to the public when, when you audit or prepare financial statements. Uh, there is also the commerce and industry where you can be employed in, in any office any kind of office, you know, that they would be needing an accountant. Um, then we have the uh, government uh, we're in. Um, you will be employed as an examiner, as an auditor of the government. And uh, of course, the fourth one is in education. Um, only certified public accountants are uh, entitled to, to teach accounting in college. But of course, in the senior high school, there is also an opportunity if you are not, or even if you are not a certified public accountant, as long as you are, you have accounting knowledge, you are a graduate of accountancy or any accounting uh, course, you can teach in the ATM uh, strand. Uh, in fact, some of our uh, graduates are teaching here in St. Paulo Colleges Senior High School and in some senior high schools in different uh, high schools in 
province. And uh, for business graduates, um, they can be employed in the, in the banks, in the, in the government also, in government offices. They can have their own business. Uh, most of our, or our students are, some of our students actually are into uh, uh, in the hospitals, in the, um, for, for the HRM or hospitality management. Uh, of course, they, they will be working in the, uh, at, uh, in the hotels and restaurants and as I said before, the in different cruises um, and uh, they also have some of them are also into their own uh, restaurant businesses. Okay na po. Yeah. Maraming maraming salamat po sa ating pong mga nakasamang bisita ngayong araw nito. Napakarami po nga na share sa ating pong mga online viewers mula po sa kanilang programa hanggang sa mga ipagmamalaki ng kanilang department at ang mga nag-aabang na opportunities right after uh, graduation, di ba? Pero ngayon po, huli na lamang na request sa ating po mga bisita. Please invite all our viewers to be part of the SPC community. Of course, particularly ng inyo pong department. Let's start with Ma'am Rose. Ang huli, magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. Uh, on behalf of the SPC Grade School Department, we are inviting all of you to be part of our community. Rest assured that we are going to give you the best and quality education that your children deserve. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ma'am Rose. Ma'am Benesina from the Junior High School Department. Magandang araw po ulit sa inyong lahat. So, I am inviting you to become part of the SPC community by enrolling your students in the Junior High School Department. Rest assured that you will offer your children uh, a value-laden instruction. Thank you. I'm Shing for the Senior High School Department. To all the students and parents out there, good morning. Um, I would like to invite you to enroll in San Pablo College's Senior High School Department because I can assure you that we will give you the best education there is, quality education, and all the skills and competencies your children or your daughters and sons needs for their college courses. Thank you so much. Thank you, Bo. For the College of Computer Studies. Okay, so again, from the College of Computer Studies, uh, we are encouraging you to be part of our department and we are truly, uh, deeply concerns on your uh, future in terms of technology. So come and join with us. Thank you. Right. Sir Bernard, for the College of Education and Graduate School. So if you want to be part of the change that San Pablo Colleges would want to create, come be with us in the College of Education and in the Graduate School and be part of the teaching force. Thank you. Well, and of course, in Olive, uh, we would like to we would like to invite everyone to be with us in our department. Uh, remember that as long as there are businesses, there will be a need for accountants and business graduates. And I would like also to to boast of uh, 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 to to tell you of our new facilities in uh, the hospitality management. Um, and uh, you, you try to visit us and uh, see our new uh, far, newly furnished hotels, Mac Hotel, and our uh, commercial cooking, our commercial cooking uh, laboratory. Um, so uh, we we expect you to be with us, and I'm I am sure that you would be trained in any field that you would like. Thank you. Maraming maraming salamat po muli sa ating po mga nakasamang bisita ngayong araw na ito. Thank you so much sa inyong pong binahagi sa ating pong online viewers. At huwag niyo po kakalimutan na i-follow po ang kanilang social media pages, uh, specifically on Facebook, para po sa updates sa kanika nila pong mga departments. Muli po maraming salamat po sa inyo and we are so glad to be uh, with all of you.
ngayong araw na ito. Sa ating pong pagbabalik, iba naman pong uh, department sa ating kikilalanin, kaya wag po kayong alis magbabalik po ang Experience SPC Virtual Open House 2020.
Ariel Joy Miaga, panganay sa tatlong magkakapatid, taga San Pablo City, Laguna. Parte na ng buhay ko ang San Pablo Colleges sa loob ng 5 years ng pagstay ko doon. Madami akong nakilalang mga tao at madami akong natutunan sa buhay. Natutunan kong maging strong at positive sa life na lahat ng problema is may solusyon and kakayanin mo yon basta sa pangarap maabot mo yon. Student assistant ako sa assessment office for almost 5 years and hindi naging madali ang journey ko noon. Sobrang ihirap pagsabay ng work at studies. Dumating din ako sa point na gusto ko na mag sa work and mag-stop sa studies at mag-relax na lang sa bahay dahil sa sobrang pagod, puyat at stress. Pero naisip ko, kung ayun ang aking pipiliin, wala akong patutunguhan sa buhay. So hinarap ko ang mga pagsubok na yun. Kasi naisip ko na hindi naman ako bibigyan ni Lord ng ganong pagsubok kung hindi ko kaya. Kaya naging positive ako sa life. Nakilala ko rin dito yung mga taong tumulong sa akin para mabut ko yung mga pangarap ko. Andiyan yung mga kaibigan ko, mga ka-office mate ko, and yung management, most especially ang Iyala family. Malaki talaga naging tulong ng San Pablo College sa buhay ko, lalo na nung naging student assistant ako dito. Dahil doon, nakapagtapos ako ng pag-aaral, which is my dream and my family's dream for me. At dahil din sa San Pablo Colleges, naging certified public accountant ako. Ako po si Michael B. Tebes, 23 years old, BSBA. Taga Cebu City. Isang tambay lang dati na wala pong pagpatunguhan sa buhay. Anin po kami magkakapatid, pang-apat po ako. Yung nanay ko walang trabaho, tapos yung papa ko lang nagtatrabaho sa pamilya ko. Sa Pablo Colleges, sila po yung tumutulong sa akin para po makapag-aral ako. At saka po para makapagtapos. Napunta po ako dito sa San Pablo, San Pablo Colleges way back 2015. Nung nakakuha po ako sa Nike Rest dati. Programa po sa basketball ng Nike. Nag-tryout po ako sa Visayas, so ayun nakuha po ako. Nung natapos ng Nike Rise, tumigil po ako sa pag-aaral. Tinulungan po ulit ako ng staff ng Nike Rise. Nag-offer po sa akin na pupunta po dito sa San Pablo Colleges. Pangarap ko lang po makapagtapos ng pag-aaral para po matulungan yung pamilya ko. Kasi, mahirap pong buhay namin sa Cebu. Di po ano, basta-basta po. Papasalamat din po ako sa San Pablo Colleges. Dahil po na sila po yung tumutulong sa akin na Financial po, ano. Ang papasalamatan ko po ay yung may-ari may po ng San Pablo College sila, Sir Nolly, Ma'am Shelly, at saka sila Ma'am Susie, at saka kay Sir Jude. Sila po yung tumutulong sa akin pag may problema po. Tapos pag may problema po sa team, lagi po silang nakasupo, na, nakasuporta po. Salamat po sa lahat-lahat. Ingatan po kayo ng Diyos, ha? Kaya po, madami pa po kong matulungan, kagaya ko po. Yung Ravens family po. Bless po ako na nakilala ko sila. Hindi man, di man kami magkakapatid. Parang touring na po namin sa isa at isa kapatid na din po as a family. Simula nung nakuha ko ng San Pablo Colleges basketball team as a scholar, malaking naitulong sa akin kasi kala ko wala akong papatunguhan sa buhay. Pero ngayon, may pangarap na ako sa buhay at gusto ko makapagtapos ng pag-aaral. Ako si Mario J. Miyaga. Ako si Michael B. Tevez. Proud, Proud scholar. scholar. Proud SPCA. Still worried about where to study this coming academic year 2020 to 2021? Get ahead with SPC. Ahead means 
alternative, home-based hybrid, education, and asynchronous distance learning. Powered by Brightspace in partnership with GLOW. It is remote learning, but we find solutions for it to reach you. We are at the helm of the delivery of instruction and will guide you all throughout the learning process. It is not all digital and online, but it is structured learning. Tailor-made by our experts to help you gain knowledge and skills. It is complete and holistic. To make you adjust and deal with the new normal in education. SPC's Ahead Learning Platform, where learning is structured, potential is nurtured, progress is monitored, excellence is delivered. Call us now and enjoy the quality education and the values enrichment that SPC is known for, but with our new system of learning. Be an SPC and get ahead. Panayam, kasama ang iba pang mga deans, department heads, at representative ng ating paaralan. Please welcome faculty member, College of Arts and Sciences, Professor Joelle de las Liagas. Dean, College of Nursing, School of Midwifery, Caregiving NC2, and Master of Arts in Nursing, Professor Maria Lisa Brion. And program head of College of Physical Therapy. Mr. Irwin Dimapitz, Faculty Member of College of Radiologic Technology, Mr. Fildon John Malabuyo, Dean, Master in, Master in Business Administration and Doctorate in Business Administration, Dr. Venus Ibarra. Magandang araw po sa inyo lahat and thank you for uh, joining us today for this Experience SPC Open House 2020. Simulan po natin ang ating panayam, no? Ito po, pagkakataon niyo po ito to please tell us more about your respective department, ang inyong pong programa, academic and non-academic activities, and of course, your clubs and organizations. Let's start with the circuit. Uh, our department is going to be uh, College of Radtech, or CRT. Um, sa College of Radtech, isa sa mga pinakamagandang organization na meron kami is yung AR. ARP or Association of Radiologic Technology Student. Um, Doon po, yung mga sudyante namin is intact. They are excelling on their own. They are um, always complying to the needs of the organization and um, supporting um, the organization not only on the um, needs on the school but the, their needs on the um, in international and um, national level po. Like, um, participating on the different seminars po na part and ESTR. So, yun lang. Thank you, Sir Phil. How about Ma'am Jo from the College of Arts and Sciences? Hi, uh, good day to everyone. Uh, College of Arts and Sciences houses at least uh, uh, three academic uh, program courses. Uh, we have the uh, uh, AB Political Science, uh, pre-course for uh, law. Uh, we also uh, have the uh, uh, BS Psychology 
which uh, uh, started the, uh, 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 this is a board course uh, three years ago. And uh, well, fortunately, uh, we have a very good uh, rating for the uh, board for the colleagues of uh, uh, BS Ecology. And of course, the flagship course of the College of Arts and Sciences is the uh, BA Communication that used to be uh, BS uh, MASCOM. But uh, with the mandate of the uh, uh, CHED, the Commission on Higher Education, uh, the uh, uh, BS Mass Communication uh, was uh, realigned okay, uh, nationwide to a BA communication and uh, we have okay we have a variety of uh, activities uh, in store for our uh, students uh, psychology uh, is uh, dubbed as uh, sumapol okay or i'm sorry i guess sikbulan okay sikbulan then for political science is a sumapol then for the uh, BA com uh, we have the MASCOM, the, uh, spelled with M-A-S-K-O-M. Masugid na alagad ng uh, sini, uh, yeah, at uh, kultura. Okay? So, well, I guess later, I will be uh, uh, sharing all uh, information regarding our colleagues, uh, the uh, College of Arts and uh, Sciences. Thank you. Thank you, Ma'am John. Aside from the academic um, organizations, CAS also has Visual Arts Society for non-academic, right? And yes. uh, now let's have Dean Ibarra for MBA and DBA. The Graduate School of San Pablo College offers Masters in Business Administration, both thesis and non-thesis programs. We also offer Doctorate in Business Administration. The, cur the curriculum is developed such that it will help the students develop their skill and develop their career. We have in our curriculum subjects like business policies, statistics, economics, entrepreneurship. And in our doctorate in business administration, we go into advanced subjects on the same subject that they have taken in their master's in business administration. But we have added others like stock market and governance. Okay, for their extracurricular activities, we, we, uh, we encourage our students to go into research and attend conferences, international and local. We actually have finished one international conferences in Phuket, Thailand, and the students have already attended about three seminars, two of which were initiated by the students. That's it. Thank you, Nibara. Now let's get to know more about the College of Nursing. Then Lisa. Okay, so our department is offering the Bachelor of Science in Nursing and that is four years course. We have also graduated in midwifery, that is two years course. The caregiving NC2, it takes about six to seven months to finish, and the Master of Arts in Nursing. I am proud to say that we have our own hospital, the San Pablo Colleges uh, Medical Center. And we are affiliating to the different hospitals, the San Pablo City General Hospitals, the National Center for Mental Health, the Philippine Orthopedic Center, and the San Lazaro Hospital in Manila. Thank you, Denisa. Hayun po, para po sa College of Physical Therapy, Sir Irwin. Good day, good day to all. The College of Physical Therapy offers the Bachelor of Science in Physical Therapy known as BSBT, which is now a four-year program uh, approved by our uh, CHED, uh, Commission on Higher Education. The first three years of study, uh, we help our learners to gain knowledge, skills, and attitude that they need, especially in dealing with their major courses and subjects. In its fourth year, they will have now the opportunity and uh, chance to enroll in our internship program with the help of our affiliation centers and hospitals together we help our learners to enhance their skills in handling real patients in various cases thank you thank you 
Ngayon po, bukod sa mga programa na um, nasa ilalim po ng ating mga departments na kasama ngayong uh, hapong ito, ngayon naman po pag-usapan natin ang pride, ang mga ipagmamalaki ng inyong uh, department. Simulan natin sa uh, College of Physical Therapy. Sir Irwin. Thank you for that uh, question, uh, Jairo. In the College of Physical Therapy, aside from the lineup of faculty members, aside from the accomplishment of our graduates and the program itself, we have this kind of practice of helping our graduates to have a stable job in the future. Because we understand that after they finish the BSPT program and passing the board examination, their main goal is to have a stable job. And so in good, it's a good thing that we have in the College of PT a group of alumni, our own graduates, who help us in terms of job recruitment. So aside from the program or the instruction, it's really the caring community yes. of CPD. Yes. And thank you, Sir Merlin. Ma'am Lisa, how about for uh, the College of Nursing? For the San Pablo Colleges College of Nursing, it has been an in, in existence for almost a half century. It has produced competent nurses, all over the world and nurse leader abroad and all over the country. It met over and above and all requirements of accrediting agencies and education standards. It is well equipped and delivers an outcomes-based education. It is resilient as it fought the challenges of online mode of education in such a short time for the preparation and with success. The dean, the faculty are seasoned and highly qualified and adapt easily based on what is demand from them such meeting and currently delivering the summons of online learning. Thank you, Ma'am Lisa. Very well said. Now let's ask Dean Ibarra for MBA and B. I'm proud to say that we are known Calabarzon to have the excellent MBA and BBA program. It is comparable to other big universities in the Philippines. We mold young students to become entrepreneurs and businessmen and to become executives. Okay, we, are, we have a total package for them. We have dedicated faculty and high quality of education we can offer them always. That's it. Thank you, Paul. Ma'am Jo, ano po ang ipagmamalaki ng College of Arts and Sciences? Well, uh, one of the things that uh, our colleagues is proud of is that uh, among the courses or the academic departments in the uh, yeah, it's at public colleges, the College of Arts and Sciences uh, is uh, level 3, uh, we accredited under Pagopoa. Okay, so I understand uh, there are only at least uh, three departments uh, who uh, um, uh, met the, the requirements of the Pagokoa and uh, one of those departments is of course the College of Arts and uh, Sciences. And our students, you know, in our department we believe that uh, uh, the cognitive aspect of our students uh, do not rely uh, in the four walls of the uh, classroom. So uh, the trust, okay, the trust of our dep uh, department is that uh, we expose, okay, we expose our uh, students to uh, uh, reality. Like, yeah, under the College of uh, Mass Communication or ABCOM, uh, yeah, uh, the graduates. Uh, have their uh, only job training with uh, national uh, networks, okay, such as the, uh, yeah, uh, should I say the defunct uh, ABS-CBN and uh, of course uh, GMA-7. And uh, not only that, uh, the school also absorb, okay, absorb uh, some of the uh, graduates uh, of uh, the College of uh, Psychology. Okay, so uh, uh, our uh, department uh, also uh, is affiliated with national organization. 
like instance for the uh, colleagues of mass communication, uh, we are members of the uh, uh, how do you call this? The PACE, okay? Uh, the, 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 the PACE as well as the COMGIL. So these are national organization for communication students. Likewise for uh, psychology, okay, they are also members of uh, uh, the Calabarison Psychology Association. Uh, the same thing with uh, our political science. Uh, regularly, uh, we attend to uh, conventions, conferences, uh, and uh, thus we believe that uh, our students okay, gain uh, first-hand information, first-hand uh, knowledge from uh, the competent speakers okay, from these uh, conferences and conventions. Thank you, Ma'am John. Sir Phil, please share with us the pride of your department. Um, I have, I'm going to highlight three pride of our department. First is our passing rate, second is our faculty, and third is our graduates. So, yung passing rate namin last year is high. Since the program is Dinawat Express PC, naging national above national level yung ano namin, passing rate. And last year, or last board exam, nakapag-produce po kami ng mataas na standard kasi isa lang po yung bumaksak na rad tech sa board exam po. And for the uh, faculty po, um, all of the faculties are young. Therefore, they are agile and they are uh, adaptable to the, to the current trends po ng um, education like online learning na hindi po nahihirapan na mag-approach towards online learning at hindi po din kami nahihirapan i-approach yung mga student namin kasi we always um, um, approach our student as our um, friend and as our um, future colleagues po. And syempre, um, yung aming mga alumni po na nag excel po on their different field and alam po namin na lah halos lahat or majority po ng aming alumni, passers are working on the um, public and private hospital po ngayon and they teach their own um, teams. Thank you, sir. Pero ikaw na ulit yung una kong tatunan sa ating next question. And of course, this question is for everybody. After finishing the programs in yung departments, ano po yung career opportunities or future na naghihintay para sa SPCNs natin? Um, actually, being a registered radiologic technologist after you pass the board exam, and aminado naman po ako na hindi naman po madali na ipasa yung board exam, but by the help of um, us, the professors and faculty members of College of Rattling, we're going to do our best to give all the things na kailangan nilang matutunan within four years. And um, yun nga po, we have, we have also a good hospital affiliation like National Kidney and Transplant Institute, um, East Avenue Medical Center, um, yung, yung ating base hospital po na San Pablo um, City General Hospital. And um, I think we're also affiliated with National Kidney and Transplant Institute. And by the help of those hospital po, um, may papagmalaki namin na career opportunities is they will become a good um, registered radiologic technologist and they can um, use different machineries like CT scan, MRI, X-ray, um, interventional radiology by using um, CR and um, nuclear medicine and other um, uh, modalities that can treat cancer po. Um, yun po. Thank you, Sir Phil. Okay, balikan natin si Ma'am John and si Dini para mamaya. Since ngayon, talagang in-demand ang uh, ating mga health workers or frontliners. For the College of Nursing, Dean Diza, ano yung opportunities for our graduates? Okay. Our students may feel all nursing career in different fields as healthcare in the hospital or it could be in a public health. It could be in education, entrepreneurship, and any other related fields like police force, fire protection, as long as a career deals with life. Our students will never run out of career opportunities. Napakaraming naghihintay ng opportunity. Yes. Napakalaki nga ng demand na gano'n sinabi ko, napakarami na nga nangangailangan sa alaga ng ating healthcare workers. Sir Irwin, for CP. Okay, thank you, Jairo. Well, uh, for the College of Physical Therapy, uh, when they finish the Bachelor of Science in Physical Therapy, 
they all have the rights and privilege to work, okay, and to have career opportunities that uh, include the following, but not limited to. First, they can work in hospital settings and even in community-based rehabilitation setup, by which they can uh, be more specialized in their tools and field. Second, they can they can go into teaching, like in my case. I'm into teaching, uh, teaching in our beloved institution, the same time uh, having my rights and privilege as private practitioner, by which it means to say that during my spare time, I can uh, go to the home of my clients and patients, uh, giving them and providing them quality care prescribed by their uh, physiatrists. You, you can serve more. Yes, and also uh, our uh, graduates, some of our graduates tend to engage in research uh, work because they like to contribute in our uh, clinical uh, evidence-based practices. And if, if ever, okay, uh, they can run their own uh, clinics and uh, engage in sports PT as well. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Balikan po natin ngayon si uh, Ma'am Jo for the College of Arts and Sciences. Uh, would you believe, Jai, that a graduate of uh, uh, mass communication, I uh, we have uh, an RA, uh, list of names who are employed in the banking industry. Uh, likewise, we also have uh, uh, an array of lists of uh, MASCO graduates who are enjoying their uh, uh, job as a teacher. Okay, Just like myself, I am uh, a living testimony that I am a Broadcom uh, graduate Adavcom, and yet I am here uh, with my students as a teacher. So you know there are varied opportunities. Likewise, uh, we have uh, uh, some of our uh, popular uh, popular lawyers in the city are graduates of uh, uh, AB uh, Political Science in San Pablo Colleges, uh, whom after which. Uh, after graduating uh, political science, they pursue uh, college of law. And well, so we have a good uh, rate of uh, uh, graduates for uh, political science. Uh, the same way with uh, our uh, graduates for psychology. So, marami sa ating uh, ano ngayon, uh, teachers. And I understand uh, ang ating uh, schools ay uh, kinukuha na nila yung graduate natin sa guidance counseling. Okay? So, well, I, I, I guess, uh, sky is the limit. Because uh, in the in our school, uh, not only in our college, but generally, it's in public colleges, we believe that uh, what we build is uh, the very person. Not only competitive, but uh, the holistic development. So it's the competence, okay? It's the competence, not only the, the, the skills, but syempre, knowledge with heart. Kaya, yun ang, and values, of course. So yun ang, uh, yun ang ating, ano, yun ang ating uh, uh, mission ng ating uh, school. Kaya, hindi mahirap, okay? hindi mahirap na makakuha ng employment ng ating mga graduates ng ating San Pablo College. Napangaraming opportunities yes. waiting for her graduates. Yes. Now let's ask Dina Bara for MBA and MBA. I like that question because that is the first question I ask my students when they attend my class, my MBA or DBA class. I ask them, why would you like to have a master's degree or a doctorate in business administration? Aside from, of course, there were some who would say, you want to find a boyfriend or a girlfriend, that's beside the point. But there were some who had that. So they said their company promised them promotion. Their company promised them a better position. So I look at our curriculum, and I'm convinced that they are industrially, industry fit. They could become an executive. They could become a CEO. They could become managers. And I've been telling them, if you ever applied for a job after your master's degree, don't you ever apply for a job lower than a manager's job. So there we go. For those who are taking their DBA, 
they're more on the academic and they have in mind to become professors to become researchers to become consultants these are the opportunities they have if they will be able to get their master's degree or their doctorate in business administration thank you so much Dina Bara. and ito po ang question na ito ikaw muna rin po ulit ang tatanungin ko para po ito sa lahat dapat Dina Bara uh, sa inyo pong palagay what makes SPC different from other schools uh, it's more of their spiritual approach to education of course they from grade school to college they always have this uh, uh, this uh, uh, thing, this uh, approach towards being uh, on the side of God, on the side of righteousness, etc. Mm -hmm. So it is academically, academically, that is on the side of the management style of the spiritual um, side. If academically, we are the only school that is offering a master's degree in business administration and a doctorate degree in business administration. And the I, mean, I said a while ago that we are proud that we get some remarks that we have an excellent program for, SP, for MBA and DBA. Students who have graduated in SPC for their master's degree and doctorate degrees are proud to say that they graduated from some public of colleges that set us apart from the others. Thank you, Nibara. Inisa. Okay. The some public colleges is different from other schools in a sense that it develops its learners holistically, integrating the Christian values and lifelong learning. SPC is always ready for the challenges of times and emergencies as it equips itself with its own learning management system so that no students of some public colleges will be left behind. Not to mention the dedication of its personnel, the teaching and non-teaching, to provide the, the stakeholder the quality of education that they came for its own, our institutions. Thank you, ma'am. Sir Irwin, ano po sa tingin nyo ang difference natin ng sa public colleges sa ibang mga paaralan? Well, for my, uh, based on my uh, personal experience, because I'm a product of our beloved SPC. SPC has this big heart, a heart that can really understand the needs of each individual. And in particular, in the College of Physical Therapy, uh, we, the, our institution, SPC, has its own uh, hospital, San Pablo College's Medical Center, that ready to cater the needs of our learners, of our PT students, even sa mga young careers pa lang. And uh, these are perfect around the only school or institution in the city yes, that we offer uh, college of physical therapy. Thank you so much, sir. Uh, sir, Phil, uh, please, ano po sa tingin nyo ang uh, difference ng SDC compared to other schools? Uh, the difference is uh, for us, syempre, the, our approach is a faculty member to our student na we always teach our student not only to learn but to love and respect their neighbors, their patient, um, their co-workers soon, their co-interns and um, future colleagues. And syempre, all those things will going to start in their home pero hindi naman nagtatapos sa bahay. Napakahalaga po na kailangan i-follow up namin yun as a teacher, as a proctor kasi Sabi nga po, di ba, uh, school is the second home of the student. So, majority of their time, they're going to spend it here, in their, in, here inside SPC. Kaya po, it is a, it's a must for us to teach them not only academical things, but also um, spiritual things and um, mentally, mentally things na um, can, uh, can affect their future careers na hindi nila mamaliitin o mamatahin yung mga tao. And at the same time, we have our, our ano nga po, or hospital na nadali po mag-approach from time to time. Kasi syempre, we are hospital-based. We need hospital talaga to learn because learning as a rat is not only learn inside the school or inside the um, institution, but also we need hospital there 
and hindi din po enough yung mga ano po kasi yung ibang mga um, internship program because we, we need to supply them um, a lots of um, learnings based on um, actual things before sila sumapak sa, sa totoong laban sa internship at saka syempre sa mas totoong laban pagka nagtrabaho na sila. So, ayun lang. San Pablo Colleges is the only school in the city who is level 3 to be accredited under Papakoa. And that means that San Pablo Colleges offers quality education. And that only quality education, uh, affordable at that. Okay, quality and affordable education. So I guess uh, that is one distinct uh, uh, attributes of uh, our beloved school, which is uh, which happen uh, happens to be my uh, uh, alma mater under the leadership of our very good dean, uh, the uh, uh, MBA. Okay, so yeah, thank you. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong uh, pagbabahagi kung bakit tayo na iiba, di ba? SPC sa iba nating mga uh, kaibigan at uh, kapatid na paaralan. Ngayon po, para po sa ating uh, huling tanong or huling request ko lamang po sa ating mga bisita, imbitahan po natin ang ating po online viewers na maging bahagi ng ating komunidad, the SPC community, particularly ng inyong pong department. Sir? Okay. Thank you, Jairo, for this kind of uh, effort for us to uh, inform our viewers, online viewers, about our departments. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, in the College of Physical Therapy, uh, I would like to invite you to visit our Facebook page named uh, San Pablo Colleges, College of Physical Therapy. So for you to be able to familiarize yourselves in our program, in our activities, even the accomplishment of our uh, beloved alumni. And, of course, we are hoping and looking forward that we will be part of your journey in your college life. And we promise that we will assist you not only by being our students, but providing you stable job. So together, we can have more brighter days. Uh, thank you so much, Sir Irwin. So, Lisa. So, I am inviting everyone to join the San Pablo Colleges College of Nursing family. For we are uh, producing a competent nurses, not only locally, but globally. Thank you. Thank you, Ma'am. It's a very short, but uh, such a statement. Thank you so much. Uh, Dini Ibarra, for MBA and DBA. I'm inviting you to become a part of the SPC community. Because education here is not offered as a means of learning, but also as a way to secure and build your careers. Move ahead with us, and you will never regret it. Thank you, Dina Tara. Mom Jo, for the College of Arts and Sciences. Ayan, sa ating mga kabataan, uh, malupit ko po kayong inaanliyahan na sana po ay uh, uh, makonsider ninyo ang San Pablo Colleges as uh, your school. Uh, this coming uh, school year 2021-2022. Uh, uh, sa College of Arts and Sciences po, kung gusto niyo pong maging uh, abogado, ay meron po tayong uh, AB Political Science. Kaya karamihan po sa mga graduate natin ay mga popular na uh, lawyers in their uh, own respective rights dito po sa ating lungsod ng San Pablo. Uh, may mga guidance counselors din po tayo sa iba-ibang uh, schools, national uh, high schools dito po sa ating lungsod, uh, which uh, most of them are graduates po ng uh, San Pablo Colleges. And uh, sa larangan po ng komunikasyon, hindi lang po pang uh, media, pang broadcast media, ang amin po uh, develop among our students but as well as uh, yung kabuuhan po ng pagiging uh, uh, communicator nila. Kaya in effect, uh, kahit ano pong larangan ang gusto nilang pasukin sa pagtuturo man po, sa broadcast media, 
uh, sa sa ano man po sa ibang larangan po na na industriya ay uh, pasok na pasok po ang ating uh, graduate ng communication okay so yeah hope to see you and uh, join San Pablo Colleges faculty next I'm sorry uh, family I'm sorry family next uh, school year thank you thank you ma'am Joy uh, lastly Sir Phil for the College of Radiologic Technology Lahat ko na nanonood ay aking inaanayahan na mag-enroll ng College of, of Radtech to become a future radiologic technologist. And syempre, ang lagi nga akong tagline na may mga Radtech is to see that. Because we can see, or by the use of different humanities, we can see that different diseases, um, different diagnoses, and um, different um, anatomical bases na ating katawan ay nakikita ng ating mga. So if you want, or if you're interested with science, with, with anatomy, with physiology, with, with different pathologies, um, why don't you um, try to enroll in College of Radtech? Promise po, hindi po mag-insihan at mag-enjoy po. Thank you po. Maraming maraming salamat po sa ating mga nakasamang bisita ngayong hapong ito. At sa inyo po mga ibinahagi na sigurado po napakaraming natutunan, nalaman ng ating online viewers about San Pablo Colleges and our programs. Huwag niyo pong kakalimutan na i-follow po ang San Pablo Colleges ating social media pages, our official Facebook page, San Pablo Colleges, a YouTube channel, and our official website, www.sanpablocolleges.edu.ph Ano pa pong hinihintay niyo? Get ahead in the new normal with San Pablo Colleges. Muli po, maraming salamat sa inyong panunood. Magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. Hanggang sa muli.